pretty significant damage increase. We got our lot damage back. It's not, it's only level 24 or whatever, but still. Should be better than the two-piece spider set. Mm-hmm. What do we have? Uh, GR39, just climbing. Definitely gonna farm more keys. Keep up with the deeps here. All right. <laughs> that spider was flipping at the camera. What the fuck? Am I? I must be tripping, dude. Am I delirious already? It's only ten o'clock. Ten p.m. Ten p.m. for blood. I got a long way to go, man. I wish I would have stopped so I went right in front of the camera. It's midnight for you? It's not too bad. I have to force myself to go to bed like at midnight. Whenever the baby goes down to bed like, you know, and then he wakes up the second time he wakes up. I try to line it up. Mm -hmm. Wisconsin? Wisconsin? You're gonna wrap it up tonight, continue tomorrow? Alright man, I'll see you tomorrow. I should be on early. I don't know how early. You know, I'm gonna try to only sleep like four hours. We'll see. Yeah, my baby is a month and a half old. Little baby boy. There's a picture on uh, my Instagram. Exclamation mark Instagram if you want to see. But yeah. He's chill. He's hanging out right now in the other room. Congrats, thanks dude. Your son's 36? Pounds? Months? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Years? <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Years? God damn! Is there a point where you're like, okay, I did all I could do? Oh, you wipe your hands clean? Or do you always worry? I know, I'm just messing with you, man. Oh, we got a COE. Can you believe that? Is there a point where you're like, ah, okay, well, I did all I could do now. Go forth and conquer. Um, 100% damage here. I wonder if I go Enforcer. Just get a multi 25. The secondary is only 90%, but each tier does give you pet damage. Hmm. Happy season start. I'll go lot. For now. For now. Okay. Blelsner, thank you for the 39 months, man. Thank you for taking the time to support what we do here, man. The stream. 
You can? You can still get them? We got a bunch. A lot of us in chat got a bunch today. Dude, we got a COE, bro. Can you believe that? I can't believe it. Two rings. I'm gonna give these to the follower, then we can give him like, uh, I guess we can give him a little bit of strength here. The strength to carry on. Helltooth. Uh, level 25 Pain Enhancer for the attack speed would be really good. But I, I don't have the resources right now to get it to 25, so... Maybe a stretch goal, dude. You got a negative 30 reduced level requirement? Grats. Granddaughter 17? Time flies, huh? I noticed that the time just is like flying even faster. I'm gonna stick to mojos, I think. Ugh. Can you believe it? My heart. Mm -hmm. Mana regen. Fetish army. Mm -hmm. I needed that. <laughs> I needed the fetish army damage. Shit. It's okay. We're fine. We got what we needed. We can always roll it later. Um, attack speed. Last I remember I was 40, now I'm 62. It goes by that fast, huh? Shit. Alright, let's uh, go to a higher torment. Hopefully the game doesn't have a meltdown like last time we logged out. I'm afraid to blink and I'll be 80. Damn. Maybe T11, at least. A little T11 action. No keystones. All right, let's see. Bro, we got Shankrani now, man. We got that speed build dialed in. Fighting aspect. No, 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 no. Stalker. Movement speed. Movement speed. Flaming dart. Can I go farm the terror gem now or something? Age is nothing but Paragon. Stop scaring me, I'm about to be 30. I'm like, this is turning into a horror stream all of a sudden. It's pretty funny. It's true though, man. It goes fast. You gotta enjoy it, you know? Play that off meta build you always wanted to play. You don't want to be on your deathbed like, I farmed all those rat runs. I never had fun, but... Damn it, we had Paragon. But damn it, we had each other. <laughs> I don't know. Another ring? A ring of <laughs> a ring of emptiness? What is this, dude? Am I hacking the game? What the fuck? <laughs> what is this? Okay. It's pretty funny, huh? 300% ring of emptiness. Physical res. Okay. And oh, we got that wormwood. You know? Mm -hmm. 
Your non fetish pets. Never mind. Deal 300% increased damage. Really? You and your non fetish pets. That's messed up, dude. That's completely targeted. Okay, well, I guess it doesn't help the build that much. I don't use it in my main build, actually. But it would count off of your dart. But that's it, I think. Still pretty cool to get. And we can use it for Arc here. We have two piece Arc here right now. Streamer luck? Yeah. A streamer luck would be like a primal. We can't get primals yet. A uh, streamer luck would be a ancient echoing fury, maybe. Look at that shrunk crony. That's the new item that they added. Oh man, that's beautiful. Get me out of this stupid map. Wow. I guess that counts as an attack. Mm -hmm. How big is this place? Oh, we dead. Oh. Three hundred percent ring of emptiness. That's hilarious, dude. With crit. And we're gone. Uh, should I use Flawless Imperial Ruby or Shard of Terror for leveling? I'd probably use the rubies. But... You can test them and see what's better. Keep them both and swap them out. It's free to do so at the... Jeweler. The 190 average damage is pretty wild. Oh, Anguish Gem? Every time you deal poison damage to the enemy, you increase your cooldown, movement speed. Nice. 10 stacks. Damn, we're gonna need Lakumba soon. The higher we go. Don't the Helm Gem shards give you all the effects of other gems socketed? What? Not until you level it up. What? This is the first time I see you play softcore? Yeah. Yeah, I haven't played for four years or something like that. It's been a long time. Or seriously, anyway. I want to do community runs. So this will be like a solo progression series to a certain point. And then I want to like play with my community, I guess. So I don't know. I think I'll do like one to one twenty solo and then branch off and then go back to playing groups. Play with some homies. Dun, dun. I know it's weird. Why don't I just play groups right now, right? But I think a lot of people in chat in my community play solo. So I wanted to do that. That run first. Another gem? What? Two gems? Three, three gems? Just kidding. That was only two. Ooh, we need some Lakumbas or some Aquila would work too. For the most part, we do drop resource, but mm. oh 
Oh man, that T eleven is hurting, hurting my my heart. I'm also not using like any like survivability, you know, I'm like, ooh, the training wheels are off or like the, you know, the ankle weights are off. I'm also like going full out. Like I have sold to waste, not languish, no armor. I have all movement speed. Wow. Okay, turbo outside. I'm enjoying it, I guess a little bit. Okay, turbo out there. We got a marijuana knife. Hopefully it's ancient. That'd be great, dude. People are like racing. It's like 10.30 at night. What's everybody doing outside? I live in like a little mountain. But it's like pretty popping. It's like one of the main roads. I live like on the top of a little hill in the mountainside. So like there's like they racing or like, I don't know. It's, I feel like there's always loud noise. And it echoes throughout the whole canyon. You know, it's like vroom. Vroom vroom. It sounds so good. Double keystone. We still haven't made a cane set. Or a whatever called chest. Ugh. We haven't made a sage set for our follower because we didn't have resources, dude. So we got a blood tide blade. Interesting. All the blood. All the tides. So now that we got Shankrani, maybe go back to Lakumba's or Aquila, because we don't have a chess piece here. But we have this one. Lakumba's is what, 60%? Strength? Oh my god. <laughs> Stop it. Hmm. 50 miles per hour and the speed limit. We got a dagger with a nice uh, attack speed on it, but no socket. I don't really have the means to be sitting here rolling sockets yet, so we'll stick with what we have. We got the anguish gem, which is great. I might try that. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of just movement and everything. For speeds, I probably would use this. Um, mm -hmm -hmm. Wonder where my uh, limit is too. Let's see. How many keys? Two keys? The seasonal theme is like a super strong legendary gems you can put in your helm. 
or your weapon. They have like almost like little mini ethereal powers. I don't like I don't have cheat death or anything. I'm just living it up, man. I'm used to <laughs> We don't have cheat death on our follower. I think I have like yeah. Oh no I do. Okay, I have it on him. I was gonna say we just super enjoying it. No ankle weights like somebody said. I got no strings on me. We got the flavor of time too, so we better enjoy that. Better enjoy that while we have it. The simple life chat. Let's go down here. Illusionist. No Nems yet. So if we roll the Kumbas, we could get Nems. That might be a benefit. I like to go for items where I get like a multiplier, like a double benefit. Like two, they like get two things that we need in one roll, you know? Like, when I rolled Helms, I needed Carnival and the Mask of Jerom. Just more chances to get loot. I wonder what my GR70 is going to be. <clears throat> what item we're going to get. Fetish army blockage. Pain gem. Another pain gem. Damn, we got a freaking Oculus ring too, bro. Can you believe that shit? Another flavor of time. That's crazy. We got the chicken set. What the hell? <laughs> I'm a DH at level 40. What weapon should I craft? A bow, crossbow, or hand crossbow? Um. Hmm. I don't know. Are you willing to go the extra distance? Or do you want the easy answer? I can go the distance. Ancient mojo too. Yeah. A flare with the socket. Plague of toads. I'll follow your way. Uh, make a level one monk and roll bows. Check the secondary. And make sure it doesn't have max discipline on it. it it's not guaranteed, but there's a chance you don't get max discipline. Then you can get a bow without it. Unless you're gonna go like greenstone fan. Do you have a greenstone or carlite? Then you can go one-handed mace. It depends, I guess. 
If you're going Carlisle or Greenstone, you can go one-handed weapon with Bolas. This is technically a damage increase, but I don't know. Adds fear on it, I don't want that. Creed's Flame. No. Nope, nope, nope. Put this away. A Pain Gem. Another Pain Gem, we might as well salvage it, I guess, right? It's useless. Unless we use it for an augment, but I'm sure it's, yeah, it's not. You have Carlize in the cube? Then you might just want to go um, one-handed mace, and that way you can use impale and all that stuff. It just synergizes with everything. You can use impale without it, but yeah. I guess synergize with your shadow set, I suppose. 665 blood shards, now we're gonna get an Aquila. Now we're gonna get an Aquila. Now we're gonna get, no. Oh. You're welcome. Uh, Zuni chess piece, two Zuni chess pieces. Cold, fire res, garg damage. I'll use it. That's about the only time you'll see me use Zuni, so. Might as well. You're welcome, dude. Either one is good, right? It just kind of depends on the direction you're going. A lot of other classes are more clear, like what you would get, but Demon Hunter, you could go. You know, like, so if you craft bows on a Demon Hunter, it can have max discipline, which would ruin your rolls a little bit. It adds another element. So if you really want a bow, you could do it on a monk, a level one monk, and then it eliminates that possibility. There's a chance, you can still get it on monk, but it eliminates like a 50-50 chance you'll get it. It can help you a lot. And if you just want to go one-hander, I usually just go one-hander because I don't mind bolas. Bolas gives you with the thunder rune, gives you a lot of resource. Sorry, I don't have a lot of information to throw at everybody. Um, <laughs> here we go, next one. Uh oh, getting trapped. Uh oh. Yeah, I said I was gonna roll bracers and then I roll chest pieces. But now that I have a chest piece that's ancient, I might go bracers again. Now that we're almost full ancient, except for the amulet. That might take a while though, to get a really good double crit amulet. If I get Carly, should I wait to level 70 to try to get Dawn? You have to, right? How are you gonna try to get the Dawn otherwise? What do you mean? Hmm? <laughs> Dawns don't start dropping to level 60, yeah. And you got no choice. Like a Hope of Cain or something? You shouldn't have any more resources. To get it. I'll be there someday. I can go the distance. Oh, thank you, Shield Pylon. Two minutes of bliss. No comment. Should I put the Carlyle in the cube or wait for the Dawn? You have to. Kind of. 
That's what I mean. Unless you, I mean, all you need is Chakram to level. You don't have to. So you're right. You don't have to actually. If you want to use it though, you can't. You know, it's just gonna sit there. I would probably just use Chakram, but it would help you with the boss specifically this season with the boss farming, right? I guess it would help you if you want to do bosses once in a while while leveling. But really, Chakram's better. Even then, Carlyze, because you're going to run out of resource constantly. And it has more wave clear and all that. Like, Chakram's even better than a Carly and Impale together. Unless maybe you had... Holy Point also? Holy Point shot? Rank 6 dock. If I only had more keys, I don't think we have any more keys, do we? No. Consumable? A Hellforge Ember? Wow. We got an Ember chat. Our first Ember and our first... Uh... Oh no, it wasn't a gift. I, when I saw consumable, I assumed it was a gift. Okay, that's why. That's pretty funny. Jade, Helltooth. Farm more keys, keep pushing. Um, let's clear this out first. Maybe there's some goodies in here. Amulet. I don't know, that double crit's too good to pass up. It's not worth the extra damage, I don't think. Helltooth, Jade. I want to put this in... An item too here. <laughs> this is a weapon gem. This is a weapon gem. The anguish is a weapon gem. Lots of weapon gem stuff. Um. I really want to use the Ember on my Drag. What do you think of Witch Doctor this season? I think it got the most changes. It's pretty fun. You know, pretty chill. A lot of quality of life changes. Things it needed. It's not perfect, but it's it's getting there. It'll be there someday. I'm gonna go Lakumbas. Or not. Sad. We're on T11 with no survivability. Hmm. Do we run it? Let's just run it. Let's do it. T11 puzzle. It's done now. Can't go back. I could definitely do higher, but I don't want the jellies. If we get a jelly to leave, I'd be super sad, you know. That's what crossed my mind. Got a nice plan. I guess I could lower it mid-game. I keep forgetting. Actually. If I'm getting farmed or something like that. Two odious collectors. That's pretty pog. I'm about to break the server with all these patterns. Huh? We get our boon of the hoarder also for speeds. 
Tormentor is pretty good. That speed belt might be better for now. The crumbs belt. That movement speed. Especially with the Shankrani, you don't take any damage. That could be an interesting combo for GR speeds. Bang. Come on. I wonder if Greed drops uh, gems too. Ow. Woo. I remember almost dying to him on hardcore a few times. One of the echoing fury chat. Please have a socket. Echo and Fury, man. Let's see what we get. This is more main stat. I will take it. This is um, not ancient, but I'm gonna try to put a socket on it. This is poison dart damage, but we really need the fetish fetish army, but this is an upgrade also. And put the boon for now. Put the boon away for now. We gotta learn all these patterns here. Look at the movement speed with crowns too. <laughs> that extra 25, it's, I can feel it, man. Pretty nice. You can feel it in my bones. We have 46 dBs. I was gonna upgrade to try to get one anyway. This way. Hope I get a socket on this bad boy. Damn, do I take off the main stat? Yeah, I want attack speed. Yeah, I think so. Whew. Leaving it, leaving main, taking off main stats tough because it's gonna keep trying to pull main stat instead of a socket. So that might have been a mistake. Had I just sacrificed like damage percent, might have been a better. How we do this? Oh, uh, we don't have 50 souls? I was gonna reforge it, maybe. Hmm. What skills do you use for Anarius? All Corpse Explosion. Keep up Bone Armor and then Corpse Explosion. Anarius is really good. More, it's better than people think. Hmm. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. So much. I'm gonna go with the drag too. I think I'm gonna bower it out. Let's see what happens. Level two. My first, uh, Ember. I was gonna save it for the Terror Gem. Um, I should save it. The Terra Gem is going to give me attack speed. I'm going to save it. Let's go farm a Terra Gem, chat. 
Terra Jam drops from Act 4. The season should be live on Xbox, yeah. I'm gonna save it for my Terra, my, my future Terra Jam in here. Okay. It should be easy for us to get around. You got the God DH set already? Really? Damn, dude. Poggers? Near. Yeah, with that crumbs belt, it's nice too. Oh, a jelly! A jelly! Please don't die, blood. A mojo? Wow. A little jelly is escaping. Hey. Little guy. Uh, nothing good, but we got, I'm assuming we got a lot of DBs for it, right? Yeah, 51 now. Near. Pretty fun. I think maxing one out would be more effective. Well, it depends on what you need, I guess. Like, I want the affix from the nothing. Damn. I guess it would depend what you need, right? Can I make this cane set yet or what? Are the sage set? Sorry. Belt. I should make this on my bar, but it's too late now. We should have already had this. Gloves. It sounds funny, but it costs materials I didn't really have for a while. I should have done it sooner, honestly, but... I just didn't really have that many mats. We're on the struggle bus for a minute. Witching hour? Oh my god. I really like crowns, man, but... We gotta go witching hour for that deeps. As attack speed on it too. I uh, had fun with crumbs. I guess I could use it in between while I'm doing these boss bounties, these boss runs. It's still really fast, it's just not as fast. Ethereals are gone. Uh, do I want to just reset or do I want to go fight like Diablo and Rakanoth? Maybe Rakanoth is chill, I guess. You could also get goblins here too. Falcon wings? <laughs> Falcon punch. I am not getting gems like like at 70 when I do these boss runs. 
They are like, nah. I'm on T11 too, man? What's the blood got to do? We'll do one more and then see how it goes. I mean, we could probably bump it up. It's just, yeah, until I get like Lakumbas, I don't really know, I don't know, man. I don't want to die too much. Alright, we gotta take it easy a little bit. Whirlwind Barb is very much viable. It's really good. It's kind of a chill way to do uh, goblin runs. We could get a bandit shrine and a goblin and stuff like that. This is a good run in general. Whoa! Nothing. Filthy POS. I'll do Azul and then... Just go grind. You know, I, need the, I need keys and stuff, so... I could just drop organically by playing. That's pretty fast, man. This could be like, uh, you could probably uh, tweak this to be like good for goblin runs. If you're hunting cosmics. You just got two off Diablo? I guess I have to kill him anyway for the seasonal journey, but he seems like this phases. It seems inefficient, you know? He's got different phases and da 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 da. Nothing. Jesus. Alright, maybe one Diablo. <sighs> this boy's got different phases. He can be annoying. Let me know if you hear a little yee yee. What's the wrong way? Fun. You got all the shards running bounties? Good job, man. It's pretty efficient with this build, but... You know. I could still be doing key farming right now, which is the most important thing for legendary gem levels and... Where are you going? Mr. D? I guess it's not that bad, we're already in phase two. <laughs> Give me your soul shards! Oh, season journey one. What do you know? We're on two now. They're still shooting him. Get him, boys! Get him, boys! Double drop. Oh, hell yeah. Good recommendation, dude. Nice. 
Your cooldowns are increased by 25%. For every skill on cooldown you take, increased damage, but you deal increased damage. Ooh, very good. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I can offset that for speeds with the Anguish Gem. I could offset it. And then for pushing, we can play whatever. Um, let's take it out of our helmet. Put on our new soul shard. Thank you, Diablo, where we now inject it. Apply directly to the forehead. Oh no, I'd take it out again. Shit, hold on. We're gonna put the ember on it. We're gonna put this ember right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's clear out our inventory for it. So you click it like a cube, like a Ramalandi cube, like a gift. Level two or one. So now we get more XP, which doesn't help us right now. Oh, well, it does help a little bit. Gold, RCR, cooldown. Hopefully it'll offset the cooldown that we're losing. Mm -hmm. We don't know what the next affix is going to be until we unlock it. Also, I want the one that gives me attack speed, basically. Mm. I mean, do I upgrade to get Lakumas? That seems stupid. Well, what else do I need that's probably jewelry? Uh, probably another Unity would be better. Another Unity. We already have COE. I need Lakumbas and I need Aquila. Those are like the two major. Uh, survivability up. We don't have any survivability right now. I mean, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling like we can get it. I only have uh, enough for two, right? Or one? Just do one. There's a currency that drops called Hellforge Embers. It's like a something you get by just playing the game. You have to right click the currency and then, you know, left click the gem you want to upgrade. No? Well... XP ring. I'll put that there. We went for it. We came, we saw, we tried. I have no key, so we're gonna farm keys for a little bit on T11. We have a pretty good setup right now. It should be pretty smooth. And then now we got the Sage set on the follower. The sage set is auto learned at the blacksmith. Don't forget, you should. Everyone should make one. It's random, yeah. So you can get a gem. So I guess I shouldn't be deleting them because you might need more in the future, right? Because they could not have the affix you want on it. So. Mm. That's the only Terra gem I have though, so that's okay. Oh right, we should bump it up. I'm just a huge glass cannon right now, so it's scary. Oh right, I hit harder with the gem now. I saw a pool of reflection up there, but maybe I'll double back and get it.
I'll be there someday. Morning Blood. Uh, right now I'm playing Lawn Dock. Or yeah, Legacy of Dreams, Dagger of Darts. That's what the game gave me, right? I rolled my blood shards on Monk. Did not get Crudus Boots. And then I was like, okay, I'm just gonna play another class. I decided to go with Witch Doctor. It's pretty chill for leveling. So I had no legendaries for a long time. I was doing T1 with no multiplier. And then I got lucky, I got a Dagger of Dart. And then I was trying to focus on it. Then I got Carnival and Mask of Jerome, right? I just kept snowballing. And that's kind of how where we are. I think we should be top 10 right now still. Oh, uh, we got Mundanugu shoulder. Okay. First piece Mundanugu. Even with a really bad RNG start, technically. Whoa! Just playing solo, chilling. I like open. I like this map a lot, so I'm just gonna full clear probably all the elites. Okay. Well, what elites, right? Looks like we did. <laughs> oh. Okay. Nothing on the map. A swift rifter. We picked up this. I could definitely use this in the cube until like for now. I normally use like squirts with the build and um, oh shit, ancient Azeroth. I could definitely put that in there. It would help a lot. Third power cubed. Harness the power of Kanai's cube. I think I'm gonna bump it up, but we are gonna be squishy here. Oh. Mm. Let's go to 13. Just a little bit. We have some blood shards. Let's go for Aquila, Lakumba, Lakumba. We need Nems also. Shit. Opacane. Crelm? I like screaming at the game when I don't get something. These have poison damage, so I guess. And they have, uh, yeah, I guess I'll equip it. Oh my god, my favorite map chat. Fan favorite. Be still my beating heart. If we can get like a, oh shit. I was like, it's gonna, if we can get a nice Condi or shield pylon would be great. We got a 10 clip. Ooh, we're getting clapped. Too high, no survivability. All those juicy DBs. Mm -hmm. 
Blue Goblin? Wow, another one. Now, here's the thing, we can't die. <laughs> Damn. They're gonna get away, I know it. Get that frozen pulse off me! No! Stop those jellies! I think we got most of them. I think one of them got away. The live to tell the tale. Oh wait! Damn. I got lax. It's cause I'm a dad now, you know? I'm sensitive to little, little jellies. Remember me forever? Yeah. Damn. This is tough. We really got to get something. We really gotta get Aquila or something like that. I've been trying, man. I've been trying, chat. What they did to me hurt so bad. Mm -hmm. Gold wrap, maybe something. I also am not really giving myself doing any favors. I could make the build tankier too instead of fast. Damn, okay. We'll go to 12. We'll go to 12. They're cutting me off. They're like, you need to go somewhere else. Let's get our fetish army out. I have one out of two unities. So, I mean, we're really close. Two drops and then boom. Two more drops and then we're there. Terror gem. I think there was something over here. Yeah, pack. Is there another one? There's got to be more room here. There's got to be more than that in the in the graveyard. Maybe this way. It's a pretty small graveyard now. Huh. Okay. How to level the fastest way possible, get power leveled. Mm -hmm. You just got double shards on a boss, grats, man. What's my favorite build and favorite character? Probably Frenzy Barb. Easily. I play it every season, pretty much. You can type exclamation mark tier for like a full leveling guide if you want. There's a lot of different methods, you know. A monk with crudest boots is pretty insane. Witch doctor massacre bonuses are pretty insane. Necromancer with corpse explosion and the gloves is pretty insane. Those are all like, you know, hour, hour and a half runs. It just depends, you know, on what you want to go for. Another puzzle ring? Wow. Let's go. Hmm. 
<laughs> Another puzzle chat. And you start getting those embers rolling in. How many keys do we have? Four? Nems? Nems? <laughs> Nems? What the fuck? <laughs> Where's my Lacumbas, man? Are you drunk? Mm -hmm. Hello? Liz? Is the... Loot system broken. Mm -hmm. The new season started, um, like, I don't know, six hours ago? Something like that. Here we go. I'll get some good um, blood shards doing GRs, so we'll just keep rolling, man. Hopefully we get it. One of the two. I wonder if there's more chest pieces for Witch Doctor or more bracers. Like, what's the higher RNG to get? Some tankiness. You think I'd just get one of them, but not yet. I played hardcore for 24 seasons. How about that? Hmm? Suck on that. <laughs> Thanks to me? Aww. I support it. I support this. I support this. <laughs> Just because I'm taking a season off, and I'm probably still going to play. I might do like a... We were talking earlier. I might do a no cheat death hardcore run as an alt, like for fun. Like a, just an alt character, you know? You can play both modes, you know? Especially like when the season starts to wind down a little bit. Not everybody logs in as much. Everyone ghosts me in groups. You know? When that hits, then I'm like, ooh, let's play hardcore again. So I might save it to keep my season spicy like I used to. <laughs> we gotta go repair, I think. It's just in, just in case. You the goat? Thanks, man. I appreciate the support. Bane of the Trapped? Hey, watch out. I'm not, I don't think I need it with the build, but still. Nothing really good. Humble question on starting a new season. Yeah. I got you. 
What's the what's the question? I'm gonna do another torment here. Cause I don't have enough to go to 70 with three. So Oh here's an ancient. I think I'll stick with the attack speed though. It's close. The speed is pretty fun. The best way to start on hard with a companion weapon after weekly and manage my way to torment? Is the best way to start on hard with companion weapon yeah. You want to use your challenge of cash. There's a lot of tactics with just the challenge of cash alone. There's a whole, I have a whole video just on that, right? You do a lot of stuff with it. And then a lot of us are doing level one boss bounties to get the new soul shard mechanic, the seasonal theme. If you type exclamation mark tier, I have a website with all that stuff on there. Leveling builds, guides, cheat sheets, you name it. You name it. These are questions I get so much, like, you know, that's why I have like a one-stop shop for all that. <laughs> Tier, T-I-E-R. Alright, don't troll me, don't troll me. I'm sensitive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pretty much everything he needs there, but I can definitely answer questions. It's just easier to have it all in one place for you guys. Wuko in general is really tough, really strong. Yeah, Wuko's great. It's a great starter, you know. Monk weapons are kind of iffy, but it's kind of hard to get. But you can build off of everything, you know. It's just a general damage set. It's like a lawn set without the ancients and the leveling up the gem and all the hard work that comes with Lon. That's our third third or fourth piece of Arik here now, third piece. I can see myself going uh, spider dog for a little bit too. Spider god. Congrats on Rainbow Gob. Uh, the first gem every season is going to be a Bane of the Powerful. That's like guaranteed. Laud typically is going to be your second gem. In some cases it can be your third. I don't know, I've never gotten it past that. The second and third gem, it's typically your second, but I've gotten it on my third a few times. That was a really high chance to drop. So you can definitely go Lod Start, which is really fun, you know? You took a few seasons off. Whirlwind Barb still top tier? Yeah, they're still pretty good. Um, I don't know how many seasons. If you remember the Lamentation Bell, it's the same concept. The Lame Intention. Oh, we're getting killed. Need that survivability. Be trying to juke that charger, like, nope, not today. Not today, charger. 
Here, find somebody else. I'm not the one. Mm-mm. What? Is the real rank 2 chair upgrade can be not your main stat? Yeah. Yeah, it can be. It's random. You can get random stuff from it. You're supposed to be f like farming a bunch of gems, leveling them up and getting the right affix on them. There's supposed to be a little RNG built in. Yeah, it's intended, I guess. Working as intended. Five. Might be able to climb now. <laughs> Aquila. Ah, da, 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 da. Just when we needed it to approach that 70. We delete this Zuni, we're not gonna use that. Da, 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 da. Cool. Um, what else? I wonder if I should do some rolls, but this gear is gonna get replaced at some point. Yeah, I don't want to waste too much resources on all of it. No crit damage. It's fine for now. Out of mats, what do you know? We can convert, no, we don't have any mats, okay. Hey, we should do group runs and after the, <laughs> so I can do bounties soon. <laughs> no, I gotta get to like, we gotta have like a one to 120 or something climb. Hey friends. Hey blood, hey Gorin. Which class is the best for starting, the easiest? If you have no legendaries, Necromancer for rifts, Witch Doctor for massacre bonuses, and then if you have stuff, probably Monk with Crudus Boots. Like if you have Blood Shards, you know, that's probably the three right now. The three craziest, craziest kids. Um, should I struggle through like a T16 to climb? What are we on, like T12? We just picked up Aquila. There's no way, dude. Are we gonna sit here and struggle through T16? Just to unlock the higher GR? Let's see. Maybe we'll get lucky with like a shield and conduit, who knows. Triple Condi. You have to believe, you know? Wave of light rocks. Okay. The damage looks like it's solid. Survivability is uh, in question. Once we get those Lakumbas, though, I think that'll be enough to do T16. That's another 60% damage reduction. Uh oh, we're in trouble. Yeah. Jailed with a savage beast hot on our tail. Look at that paragon <laughs> saving me. I would have been dead already again.
Oof. Hmm. Maybe I can go with Spirit Vessel. Sacrifice something for more survivability. Ooh. Tough one, too. When you die, you lose all your fetishes, so that makes it even harder to bounce back, also. Grats, man. Good job. Yes. I was hoping for you, shield. Two minutes to clear the rift. Go, go, go. I got, uh, something. Yeah, double drop from a chest. Okay, ice climbers. That's good. I won't get jailed. I got killed earlier by getting jailed. Get some stone gauntlets too. Be sexy. Gonna come in handy. I got a Diabo. That's pretty cool. Fly, thank you for the 10 months. Good luck this season, everyone. Oh, thank you. That's nice of you to say. Good luck. May RNG be with you guys. Hey. May it look over your shoulder and follow you in every corner. And then we get this crappy map. Really? It's probably the other way. Probably across here. No? Hmm. It's like in the middle chunk, usually. Farming chest farm. The new uh, spider dock chest farm build. <laughs> it's on the bottom, I think. Near. Multiple elites, multiple bogeys inbound. Read it loud. Hmm? If you have a three man team, do the bounties you join claim the caches? Is that against the rules? I've been doing solo South Found for years, man, but I never actually f like joined the league and did all follow the rules. I just played whatever I wanted, yeah. Like I support the unofficial league, I just don't. I never even submitted one clear, right? <laughs> so I have no idea, dude. It's a self-imposed rule set, so. I would imagine if you get any outside help, it's against the rules. That just makes common sense, I guess. Right, this is a bad idea to try to fight through it. It's not going well. It was going well, and then we got Shrouded Moors, but... Maybe we don't give up so easily. Man, that Reflect is just destroying our whatever. Yeah, these Hell Witches, huh? No fap club? <laughs> Exclamation mark no fap. Might have to uh, lower it and climb the normal way. Maybe. But that's what quitters would say.
Ooh. Channeling. That would help me keep up, um... John. Go DPS. I'll never take me alive, see? I'll get through this map. If it's the last thing I do. Maybe not. Oof. But maybe, but then again, maybe not. S25 hype. Looking forward to another season. They're gonna kill me, Chad. I can feel them getting closer like sharks. Yo, Randy, thank you for the nine months, man. Cheers, bro. There's been seasons where I just played solo, but did bounties because bounties suck, right? Yeah, I mean, it's just really whatever you want to play. What is this? Oh. Ah, <sighs> finally. Relief. Sweet release. An uh, oasis in the desert. You know, pretty good. But will we have the damage to do GR70 though? If this is that that tough, GRs are a little bit easier in terms of scaling. We got a Spider Queen grasp. Wow, 800% multiplier on that bad boy. Ramalandi cube. Damn. We got about half of our shield left, so we gotta make a count. There might be elites at the door still from earlier. About, what, 30 seconds left? Before we go back to getting farmed. About 15, 10 seconds. Would I revisit Cyberpunk? Probably not, because I know the whole story, you know? I can't say goodbye to Pam again, man. That was, I really fell in love with her, I think. If she was an NFT, I would give my whole life savings. <laughs> so close. I don't know. It has to be archers too, like it can't be any other mob type. Now there's no reason for me to play it. If I already know the whole story, that was part of it was to experience the story. Unless there's like an online like GTA, like I don't know if there's like an online community. Like a uh, cyberpunk RP, I don't know, maybe. You never know what life has in store for us. I'm gonna go look for a pylon to complete this map. We're so close. I'm not really worried about the RG. We have pretty good single target.
Not really, anyway. I'm worried about this guy about to charge me. Yeah. Been waiting a long time. We have a cyberpunk let's play on Twitch, I think? Might be on Twitch or YouTube. Twitch. I think it's my only Twitch let's play. Like Twitch exclusive. Uh, we're red. You got red on you. It probably would have been faster to just climb, you know? We would have got resources and shit. But we got the Spider Queen and Messerschmitt. Oh, we got a gift out of it. it. Looks like a brood of RNA. We got a whole spider kit, dude. Tubular, man. What's your top character look like? What do you mean my top character? In Diablo? This is my top character. Sorry, it looks like shit. <laughs> Wait, what's your main blood? This can't be your main, right? This can't be your main. What's your actual character? What is it? <laughs> so close. Uh... Reflect is really tough right now with my low survivability. What's the secret of getting into my clan? I don't know. Apply and hopefully my mods show mercy. This guy hits so hard. It's unreal. I'm back. Ninety nine. I mean, I might get farmed by the RG. Actually, I don't know. I'm just assuming we'll be okay. Damn, this reflect. Ninety nine percent. No gold wrap. Nothing, dude. You have to ask Smith. Maybe we'll get a pylon to go with it. Oh, hey guys. This wasn't a good idea, but you know, it's, it is what it is. We ripped the bandit off, it's done. We'll see how it goes here. Another reflect pack. Another reflect pack. Yeah, single target's pretty good. You can see he's already at half. Let's just try. Oh, speed, baby! Meow. Frustrating. When does the Rift Guardian not follow, you know? Come fight me over here. <laughs> he 
He's like, nah, I'm good. You just wasted your time, blood. Is he back? He's here? Quick, before more elites come! One more time and then that's it, they're gonna cut me off. Another elite, another reflect pack. Oh my god, this is hurting so bad, my heart. Uh. Man. Bloodlust? What do you mean bloodlust? Your account name, your character name and your account name might be different. Look at that. We got Spider Queen Grasp and the Spider Queen Belt just out of nowhere. And then I think we have a three piece Arik here. We have one we're wearing, right? Which I'm probably going to swap it with Frosties. So we got a three piece Spider set, which is nice. We could even throw up that Wormwood on there. We got a gift. Pretty nice. Messer might work in the build. We got Wrath of the Waist Shoulders. Are we mentally ready to go back? Are we mentally ready for this? Already double procced. I only have two fetishes out? Isn't it on hit or is it on kill? What? Hit? I definitely hit a grip of times now. Wow. What? Unless they're running out of range or something. Hello? Is it bugged with this rune? Maybe I should do a different rune? I have no fetishes out. Look at all these hits. One. We should use um, fetish army to, to finish the Rift Guardian. Jesus Christ. Hello? Fetish? I, I, what? They're all dead or what? Maybe there's like a weird hitbox issue with this that I don't know about. <laughs> oh my god, bro. We're so close. It's giving you five times gems. There's a bug with Broken Crown. I, I haven't noticed that. That's crazy though. Maybe somebody could take advantage of it in chat. I might need this life on hit. This guy's gonna come clap us. What a waste of time with this shit. And now I'm so pot committed, man. 
I can't go back. This is like playing uh, the PoE story mode. You just throw your dead body at the content over and over. Like if you're bad at the story, I guess. You can just keep going at it over and over. Ah! Can you do you believe? He just, he can't even juke that. He just instantly targets you. Alright, we got fetish army. I guess I could spirit walk it. <gasps> what a nightmare. I gotta edit that out of the VOD though. Yikes. Playing Dark Souls over here? Yeah. I don't know what was going on with my fetishes, man. I'm supposed to have like 15 out. It's a lot of DPS we're losing, you know? Let's have like at least 15. Zombie charger, if it was ancient, maybe. Please give me Lakumbas. After all that pain, we don't have resources. Okay, I have enough for one. Parthens. Young Parthen. So now we could attempt a GR70, but if it is anything like that, then but we could do stuff like languish. Maybe there's a glitch with this, I don't know. You know, jaunt. I like severance. I might stick to severance, but. Instead of Slam Dance, we can go Ghost Trance for survivability. You know? Legion of Daggers, I guess, but we shouldn't need it. If anything, we should go with um, Horrify Stalker for or whatever the armor rune is, frightening aspect. Yeah, we have enough movement speed with Severance there. If um, SSF was officially supported in D3, I would, I would definitely be all about it. I would like it even more, yeah. I hate competing against all the crazy Paragon grinders, you know? At least I would only compete against one mouth breather in, in his, you know what I mean? <laughs> Instead of so many. It would help. Cooldown, attack speed. Life, all res, maybe go life. And then like they use like bounty programs and stuff like that, bounty bots or whatever. I mean, it just eliminates a lot if it's only solo. It helps, it helps a little bit. It doesn't make it perfect because you can still bot, but it definitely helps. All right, let's try a GR70. I don't know if we're gonna do this. I'm just gonna be honest, okay? I don't know. But I'm going to try, chat. But damn it, we're going to give it our all. Hoorah.
<laughs> out of arcane dust. <laughs> Okay. I mean, level 70 is only Torment 15, right? So we just did a... So that should be... We, I might actually destroy this, I don't know. Or get destroyed. I might try different runes too, because it doesn't seem to give me all my fetishes. There's eight. Okay, there's eight now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what's up, Phantom? How you doing, man? Kill this ghost. Number one. Yeah, this should be no problem. Unless maybe we get red archers or something crazy or lashers, impalers. Whoa, 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 whoa. Blazing Guardians, speed. Witch archers get Jade, so I decided to go Lawn. The game gave me some Dagger of Dart stuff, so we've been playing Lawn Doc. It's been fun. You know? Shield Pylon, GG. Call it. GG's. Over. This is going to be the challenge rift next week, so pay attention, okay? He just boosted three monks? What's wrong with you? Giving in to power levels? I'm just kidding. Good job, man. <laughs> How dare you? Holy pylons. The progression's going up so fast that it's just like, next pylon's possible, next pylon possible. So we're kind of snowballing, it's an open map. I have shield, yeah. I don't remember struggling this much with like our fetish, like we only have three, dude. Like what? I wonder if like the rune, so you can use the different runes now. Or like... There's a bug. I, I have three right now. Maybe I should try the transcendent spell. The transcendent spell is only on spells, right? We got uh, primal, blackthorn. I wouldn't want anything else. We got a Vu's Juicer. That looks like another... Oh, a Unity! Oh, double Unity! Can you believe it? Sorry, I've been through a lot tonight. Double Unity. Pretty good stuff. Ah, oh, it feels good. I don't have enough to re-roll, unless it has a socket. Unless it has a socket, please. No, ancient though? Ancient though? This is Blackthorn, dude. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I don't even, yeah, we don't, we can't, if we have to do like, oh, we have 28. I mean, gods be good, gods be great to us. Thank you. I, I really appreciate that, universe, if you're out there. I've been uh, dying a lot, so this would definitely help me. Yo, what's up, Phantom? Should I be using a Templar as a DH? If you need resource, or if you're playing hardcore, this is kind of like a cheat death protection. Like if you disconnect, disconnect protection, you have five seconds of immunity. It's pretty powerful. Pretty powerful stuff there, partner. So I put the unity on the follower. Put the lotion in the basket. And now we just picked up 50% more survivability and I can get Lakumbas right here just like that. Hey. I could, but I won't. It's true. That's 60% uh, more. And then if we get Stonies, you know, we have Ice Climbers. <clears throat> I watch you, I watch your videos, but I don't have you on follow on Twitch. No worries, man. Yeah, I've been streaming Diablo since season six. I've been making content on YouTube since season three. Something like that. Something like that. So, I appreciate it. I'm going to stream Diablo most of the season until Lost Ark comes out. Something like that. What are these lawn docks doing, huh? Oh, we're rank one lawn? Oh shit! Oh shit, can I go up seven levels with unity? I don't know, that's kind of crazy, huh? Easy rank one? This is too much, because we couldn't even do T16, right, but... Our gem is only 40. Woo! I didn't change it! I was gonna change the rune! I was also gonna change the rune, chat. Here's some support for all of the videos I watch, bro. I appreciate that, dude. Thank you for uh, supporting the videos and supporting the stream. Much love. It's nice when you're not getting lariat all the time, getting choke slammed. Eleven. Like we need at least max fetishes all the time with this build, so I don't know what's going on. I played this a few times in my life. Never had this issue. Might have to go SMK or something. I have 12 right now. Foot fetish? For the right price. Bacon with the 16. Yo, thank you, man. I appreciate that. You're number three? Nice, dude. Grats. Much love. Hope everyone has a holly jolly Christmas. We also got, um... What's that called? Essa Johan? So it's grouping them up a lot, not just right there, like not just Prana Nato. I think the Prana Nato proc at the same time also.
And then we have strong arms, right? So it's proccing strongies. On top of that. Oh, you're right. That's why they're dying. I do have Enforcer, but it's not leveled yet. I thought the rune was tripping or something. That's a lot of DPS we're losing when they die. Thank you, man. I'm thinking they're invincible, like a lot of pet builds, like, you know, Rothma. Pretty much like, yeah, they really don't die like a lot of builds, like Monk, you don't have to worry about it. Or I guess once you have Enforcer, you don't worry about it. It's never an issue, yeah. Huh. That's probably what it is. We'll level it up. A monk is amazing if you get crudest boots right away. Really, really good. Mm -hmm. A lot of characters are amazing though, but monks are like extra <clears throat> with crudest boots. You may have to play this season. Mm. Yeah, I'll probably play like um, Inna's, Marauder. We play some of the popular builds, some of the off meta stuff. Quick before shield goes away. Woo! I'm awake. Got a drag of lies. Moratorium. Hey! Get these zombies off me. How long does it take to level a character? Uh, like two to five hours, depending on a lot of factors, things, skill. Seven overall. It's pretty good. Playing some crappy off meta. Oh, the Thrill Conquest. We took off the green. I got a shard off the first gold goblin I killed. Did you know about this? It is just random, so you got lucky. Right? It's just, it's possible. To get it off of, like, a rubble. You can get off anything, you know? You can get off all the time. <laughs> it just depends. Let's see, 95%. I wanna have his physical. Mm. My boy Blood. You guys are fun, man. Thanks for spending your season with me. Now we're going to get Lakumbas and shock the world. Okay. Should I keep going? I think we should level Enforcer. So like maybe 60 speeds. How many keys do we have? Six. I think we need an Enforcer at 25 just because it's really hurting our damage. I didn't even realize. 
I'm just in go mode. I'm like, farm, 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 go, go. What's the next build? How am I going to make this better? How am I going to make this better? Firebird is not a channeling build anymore. It's not the best, no. Twister is better. Or they're super close. They both should be able to do a 150, so it's like the same thing. Anything in my A plus tier or S tier is essentially the same, right? They're both gonna do 150, so. It's a matter of who wants to do it sooner. What happened with your plans on making a monk? I didn't get Crudus Boots. I didn't feel like leveling monk <laughs> without Crudus Boots. But it ended up being, I don't know man, I like when things go wrong. I've had a lot of seasons where things go wrong. You know? It makes it really fun for me, like, to build, like I never played Lod Doc in the start of a season, I don't think. This is what the game gave me. Mm -hmm. Just kind of build whatever the game gives you, it's pretty interesting. Season 25 is live, man. Five is live. Enforcer would help our cure if and when we switch over to Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Enforcer. Here we go. And we got, oh shit, we got stone gauntlets, dude. That's huge. Probably go back. Drop the ancient even for that. Huh? You're gonna make monk? Make monk roll boots. If you don't get it, you can make a demon hunter, upgrade daggers. Or go necro upgrade. I guess that would have been that would have been the fastest if I went necro and upgraded, um, you know, a two-handed scythe. But I kind of felt like playing Doc because they have a lot of new stuff too. Tall man's finger. Oh, this is ancient, so that's kind of a wash at least. Like this. Mm-hmm. Echoing Fury. Potion. I don't know if so now now we got even more survivability, which is great. Uh, Lakumba time? I shouldn't roll in between rifts, but I want them so bad. 25 million to empower. Okay. Alright man, I'll be live all day Saturday. Maybe I'll see you then. Have a good night.
Yeah, it's late for some people now, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'll be streaming all weekend, all next week. I'll probably do solo, maybe all launch weekend, and then groups on Monday. Something like that. Maybe that'll be my thing. It'll be like... Launch weekend, solo, progress, something like that. I don't know. I'll give everybody time to level two and do stuff. Elite, hello. Hello. We feared him with Echoing Fury at range and he didn't charge us. That was pretty great, actually. I don't mind that fear. We still have shield, so we're chilling. Yeah, he was about to charge us and then the fear proc from Echoing scared him away. I would not do bounties before like T13. That's crazy. But maybe T7 is the bare minimum I would do, but it's uh it's hey, it's on you, you know. It's just it's just low chance for you to get something. You're doing T16 and you haven't got it in 9? Wow. Okay. Yikes. Sorry to hear that. Yikes. That's pretty bad luck. Two, three items a run. There's only like five items in the item pool, right? We got a real gift finally. Or our second one. Tall man's finger, another puzzle ring. Beautiful. Maybe 10 times. It's tough. Mm -hmm. You just keep on blasting. You can spend one weekend and balance them all out, yeah? Uh, Inez and Lawn Bomb are the strongest builds in the game, but there's like a bunch of classes that can do a 150 solo, so it's splitting hairs now, right? There's like 10, 15 builds that could probably do a 150 solo. So it's kind of like, um, how fast do you want to do it? How much time do you want to put in? Or do you just want to play whatever you think is chill, you know? It's just a lot of factors. What's the most fun? Um, Inna's Monk is fun. If you never played it, Mara the new Marauder rework is fun. It's how it used to work. The sentries shoot your spenders and fire when you do, so it's just like everywhere probably melt the server in groups right um if you like witch doctor there's a lot of quality of life changes like ring of emptiness works with pets um your pets can proc oculus rings lakumba's only needs like one stack technically one to three stacks to keep up uh, 60 percent 
There's a lot of little things like that that make it better. The spider set got reworked. Wizard's good. Wizard has two strong builds. There's a lot of bright spots, I guess. Sentry's auto shoot, yeah. So like if you have a multi-shot, right, then they just automatically shoot multi-shot constantly. It's pretty fun to look at. Wow. I straight crashed, which sucks because... Whoa! Blue screen. Wow. That wasn't even the server, my PC died. Whoa. Alright, it's a good thing I have two PCs. Yikes! The, the 30... The 3070 Ti just exploded, probably. You smell that? 3070 imploded. Too hot? No. At least I don't think so. I just like making jokes. Let's see what happens. Let's see if it comes turns back on. <laughs> D3 is just too much for this. D3 is just too much, man. Can't handle it. I just talked about the, it's funny, I just talked about Marauder blowing up the server and then my computer blows up. Predicted? Bloodstradamus? Alright, let me, um, so it turned on, that's good. That's, that's a good thing, right? Can Flawless Gem still drop from Salvaging Shards? Yes. Yes, they can. I tested it last night on Asia before even, and then we tested it all day on Europe and on stream when the season went live. All right, cool. Should be good. We should be good. What paragon am I? I'm 322, just solo witch doctor, chilling off meta. Hanging and banging, brother. I just didn't even get my turn in, so I would have maybe been 323. That's the video guard. Or if I was on hardcore, we might have died, dude. Crazy. I didn't get my gem ups either. We didn't get our blood shards either. That's so sad. That hurts. I'll never get that back. We empowered it. Damn it. Hopefully it doesn't happen again, I don't know. I never had that happen playing Diablo. It's crazy. Jade, Zuni, not gonna play Zuni. Two gifts. I feel like I didn't get a gift for a long time uh, last season. I wonder if they stealth buffed it. I'm, I live on the west coast, so it's only 12.30 at night. Only 12.30. California, San Diego, California. Right under the train tracks. You can tell by all the cars driving by and stuff.
You're in Oregon? What's up, dude? How's life in Oregon? A lot of breweries out there, I think, right? Good breweries, shitty governor. Governor? Mm -hmm. You live in Vegas? I think I would very much like Vegas. Some dining and shows all the time. It's like a desert, but... I like to go to bougie restaurants, you know? And dive bars, too. Residency. It'd be nice to get all our gems to like, uh, I don't know, 50 or something like that. For this build, we just need Enforcer and Lawn. Stricken, but Stricken's not as important. We need Stricken to 25 and leave it there for a while. When you're living here, you don't want to do that all the time. You, get, you don't get used, you don't, yeah, you're like jaded by it, I guess. Um, maybe. I live in San Diego, it's not like Vegas, but... I don't know. I don't get tired of the crowds or like um, going out or anything. It's definitely not the same, but you know, I guess on a small scale I don't really get bored. Maybe just a vacation home then. Just a quaint rental. Firebomb, no. Mempo. Good old Mempo, dude. Want to party all the time. Maybe everybody would want to stay with me. They'd be like, oh, we, don't, we can just stay with blood. We don't have to like get a hotel. That might be the downside. <laughs> I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> Here's the thing, no. If you want builds, you can type exclamation mark tier. I have a website with all kinds of builds on them. It just depends on what you're playing, you know? Different builds have different shards. Secondaries, primaries. Just walk through all those beams. A bunch of people just died? Odin died? Wait, I don't have I don't have any of my chat up. Is that is that that happened a long time ago?
This just happened right now? How come chat is blacked out? I thought I wanted my 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 clan chat. I gotta fix that after this. I don't want clan chat to be blocked out. F. I just want the normal chat. Mm -hmm. Damn. Let me fix the settings after this. Yeah, see, look. Okay, so I do have clan chat up. Alright, that's what I thought. I was like, wait, what happened to my clan chat? I guess just the message, like the system message was darked out, blocked out. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Base bow. One more, then we get this to 25. Another pair of ice climbers. One more pair. We got Gogok too. Hopefully this icy climber is ancient for my LOD build. Hey blood, got two of Inna's hardcore. HCS. Wait, wait, what does HCS mean? Mm -hmm. Oh, we got a gold wrap? Okay. Hardcore solo? That's what I thought, but maybe it means an item or something. Oh, hardcore season? That's what I thought, but I was unsure. Want to confirm. Another pair of NEMs. Let's go crit. Maybe life per hit. Very nice. This build's chill, man. I feel like I can make it better too. The anguish gem has an on death explosion. Like that would be great for speeds. That's what I use for speeds. Or I have the I have it in my build anyway. So like that's one thing we don't have is a lot of AoE, so that would help. It'd be like just little bombs going off. But we only got one ember tonight. How many embers you guys got, actually? Hmm. I got one Hellforge ember. Zero? Five from Mad Dog. Shit. Okay. Two, one, one. Okay. Zero. Interesting, huh? Nine inches got four. You got 40 and 800 Paragon? Jeez. Playing on EU? 40? God dang. Crazy. I'm playing softcore to start. Uh, to play with my community um, after the weekend, maybe. Do some group runs for a while. And then I might uh, I make an alt, play some hardcore again. Level 15? 
Zero at 84 Paragon, one for you. 27 yesterday on EU. Damn, you got you guys got some drops. That's some crazy. I've only gotten one and I used it. You got three, Galley? Okay. Yeah, I used it on my um, Terra Gem. The Orc's Crown. Save a few of those. Now let's take our Dream Gem. Higher. It's at a 44. The Terra Gem drops from Act 4. Bosses. Or you can just play the game and it could drop randomly anywhere. But if you want to target farm it, you can... I got it off Diablo. New day, new bit counter. <laughs> Maybe. Hey, thank you. If you type exclamation mark easy, I have a video um, and then I, there's a list of all the places where you get all the gems. But um, pain drops from act four also. Pain and Terra both drop. They both drop for it. To answer your question. I mean, uh, Dagger of Dart's gotta be pretty off meta, like maybe like um, B tier maybe? I might have it in the A tier or the B plus, I forget. Imagine if I had Crudus Boots. <laughs> or Marauder, I was playing Marauder or something crazy. Cracked out. It's in your feats of strength, because it's like uh, gone now. Yeah, it's like in the, it should be in your feats of strength. Oh, I should um, transmog something with ethereal. If we have it, I don't. Maybe we don't have it on the season. Maybe it's only non-season. No, that'd be waste, huh? Oh, we got Zay's. I forgot about Zay's, man. Another RQ. We might be on Spider Dock tomorrow. We might be on Spider Dock as our alt. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Lakumbas. Let's go. One season I played Witch Doctor, it took us 800 Paragon to get Tasker and Theo. I have a feeling this is a Tasker and Theo type of situation. One fateful season. You can just press enter while salvaging. Thanks for the tip, man. I had no idea. Power pylon. If you have any more tips, can you please send them to www.www.www.www.bloodshed.com? That would help me out tremendously. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
It was 18. It was 18. The World Wide Web. But it's a good way to farm DBs when you're lower level. What, what's the lower level? Like pre-70? Or like low Paragon? When you hit 70, the Sage set is auto-learned at the Blacksmith. Once you hit 70 and max out your Blacksmith, which you should do with your, you know... You get a Sage set, and you give that to your follower. Right? So save up materials to make this and give it to your follower. I kind of love that you guys can see the whole screen because now I don't have to worry about it. And then now you get an extra DB every time. DBD DBD. You already have it? Okay, well then what are you asking me for? Go kill some elites. That's great. <laughs> I don't know. Get out there, son! Go kill some elites! <laughs> Go be somebody! <laughs> mm -hmm. Farm at an efficient- farm like in an efficient... Like... Torment. It should be at least on Torment 1, right? But... Don't go to Torment 2 if you're torment- if it's really slow. Just try to be as efficient as possible. Wandering after midnight. Every build is different, right? Everybody's at a different stage of progression, so wherever you are, just make sure you're killing fast and getting those drops per hour. Was that? Another puzzle ring? Bro, what? The Unity and then the Stone Gauntlets, Ice Climbers really helped our survivability, I think. That was the difference, the difference maker. That way, where we're on T16. And not dying over and over and over and over. Oh, I was trying to pop it, but oh well. You had the worst barb start. If you're playing barb, the best way is to do Act 2, Temple, the Firstborn, Masker bonuses. Rend and then leap away, right? Get them, get them when there's like a few enemies left. Rend them and leap. That'll keep up your massacres easier. But yeah, it's gonna be tough, but Rend is really strong. That's like your number one go-to. I saw those bracers, but no Lakumbas. We have Condi. We might as well just run through, yeah, and kill things. You put that side of the cycle in the queue, good man. Get it. You don't know anything about the season? It's really easy. Check it out. Type exclamation mark tier, T I E R. A 
scroll down to whatever class you're playing. I have level guides, recommendations, cheat sheets, all that stuff. Hey, easy clap. On the low low, I might run a puzzle ring here. Completely free. No BS. He's starting the grind now. Yo, thank you for the three months. Starting the grind, yeah, man. Yeah, I've been playing solo off meta doc. It's been a blast. You don't like Tempest Rush? Oh man. Poor little TR. It's okay, I like you. Shit, this T16 Goblins is real deal, man. Maybe they were just like, the darts weren't hitting him on the stairs, maybe it was glitched, I don't know. I probably missed a few gold piles, I don't know. I feel like I did. Maybe I run back through after we kill Greed. Ba -ba. Good morning, what's up Nepsy? How you doing man? Shit! That is crazy. I um, don't know why four stand still didn't work. Let me get this before I die. Have a holly jolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. That guy's fast, dude. Not today, Satan. Not today. Double ring drop, triple ring drop. A Stone of Jordan and another Unity. And a Tasker and Theo. Pretty good drops there. Let's see if we missed any gold piles. I have a feeling I missed one at least, but... Mm, um, no, I guess not. Okay. Happy the new season's here. I haven't stayed up this late playing games in a while. Yeah, man. I love me a new season. Got the new season glow. All the items. The double crit unity, wow. Keep that task or two. Maybe we upgrade our gems now. How far can we go? Or I might need them for... Yeah, we don't have the patterns either. I might need them for... 
other things like crafting and stuff. We'll just wait. It's not that important right now. But what's important is getting these Lakumbas, right? Oh, coils. For Firebat. We have four keys. Let's keep uh, leveling up our Law Gem here. I should have to bump it up after this, though. 49. You're hungover? Yeah. What'd you, uh, drink? You sound like a guy that drinks meat or something. Meat or moonshine? Meat? Fist of Heaven got buffed? No, but it's good for speeds. So that's pretty much what you're gonna use for speeds, or that's what I like to use. You know? Nice wings, thank you. Hey, okay. I appreciate that. I can't believe I didn't level Enforcer early. It would have saved me some hardship. Lost Ark is uh, November or February 11th, yeah. Your European dates made my brain explode. <laughs> I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. You got me, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm going to make content for Lost Ark and um, play it. I've already been putting a couple hundred hours in the game. I don't know when. There'll probably be a section on the website, right? Even now, sometimes people ask me for PvP builds, leveling builds. Even now, chat. Season 25 is active. Get in, the water's warm, dude. I just failed the 90% one. Okay. Arakir chess piece, that's beautiful, beautiful. That is a five piece. If we had the Ring of World Grandeur, six piece. Six piece chicken nuggies. Oh, we got the Simplicity Strength finally also. This is a part of the build. So now we should get this 25. Crazy. It was like the last one or one of the last ones, it feels like. And then we're going to get Lakumas right here, so that's good. Dope. <laughs> It'll work out one time for the clip and then we'll look like a genius, right? So we'll keep doing these. I, it costs uh, 25 million to empower. We have three keys. So let's do another regular rift to get this key up.
Whoa. Taking some damage here. Kind of sloppy. We're not at T16 gods yet, but this map is also a little weird. Once we get simplicity, maybe. Up a little bit more. Let's go, Echoing Fury. Let's go. And when we get one more level of the Terra Gem, too, we get a lot of attack speed from that. Lots of survivability from um, using our primary skills with the simplicity gem also we don't have. We can get boon to 25, we have a gold wrap. So many DBs already. How many do we have? 327? We don't even have, that's the problem is that you don't have the materials to support. Like the materials are more harder to get as at a certain point. We're already at that point. What was, what's the easiest way to level if Kadala totally screwed you over and you got nothing? Um, you go Witch Doctor for Masker bonuses, or you go probably Necromancer, honestly. This, I think you'll have a better time. Because you you have your, um, do you still have your upgrade? Wait, do you have your upgrade still? Like your, your uh, Hope of Cain? So Necromancer has four possible outcomes and all four are a multiplier. So you guarantee, the same with Demon Hunter, there's only two possible outcomes. Both of them are dagger multipliers. So if you want to play it safe, you can go for one of those classes. Or um, yeah, Witch Doctor is great too. But you're not going to have a multiplier, which can be tough at max level. I went Doc because it's new, right? Because it has some new toys to play with. And uh, I had no multiplier, so it, I had to just wait till I get, got something. Six keys should get it to 25, so that's cool. Another ancient. This has attack speed. Hails, yeah. Even better. 
These are ancient, even better. Take it. Uh, Lod, Lod Bomb can be really tanky. It's any Lod build can be tanky because you can use like Ice Climbers, you know, Unity usually, or there's like a lot of things, Aquila. You can get tanky, so. It just takes a lot to gear, right? Where like you can play like a set and get there pretty quick. If you don't mind the gearing process, it's uh, probably one of the strongest builds in the whole game. Lod bomb. I don't mind gearing lod. I just, um, I think I played a lot of lod bomb like back in like back in the day, so I never recovered from it. I played like one season, like maybe season five, it was really good. And then I just never recovered. <laughs> I like it though. I, it's fun for speeds too. I'm more of a Fist of Heavens kind of guy, but still. I like the Fist. <laughs> <laughs> it's more targeted I like to cast a spell and things explode yeah it's more um, visceral yeah for sure like wave of light or something you know you're casting it Hey Blood, what's the new seasonal theme? They're like um, super legendary gems. You can put one in your helmet, one in your weapon. They have randomized, a little bit randomized powers on them. Legendary powers. You can use them as an augment. You can wear them. You can salvage them for gems, like lots of gems. Pretty cool. There's like a currency that drops so you can level them up. It's the most, in my opinion, it's the most like complete seasonal theme we ever had because it's like a currency and a whole system, some farming to do. It's an actual like real life mechanic. <laughs> Even though it's tiny, it's still a mechanic. It's really good. You can make uh, speed builds out of it, push builds, group builds, there's different things. And there we go, we got a Ember, our second Ember, dude. Our second Ember. I hope I get this. Actually, you don't get the second Affix till level 3. I wonder if we should keep going or, or put one point over here and drag so it gets more stats, probably. Damn, I, somebody asked that earlier. Do you level evenly or do you push one? At level three, I can get attack speed, which is really important. <laughs> what level can you socket a helm? Uh, level five, you can get like a Leoric's crown drop, technically. If you get the legendary. Uh, do you have a video on which shard goes to which build? Yeah, every build has a build guide on my website. You just have to hover over it, right? So I'm looking at my La Dagger of Dart build, just as reference right here. All right, the gems are in there. Right. 
Every build's unique, right, to what you need. <clears throat> You're going to bed? Alright, man, thanks for hanging. Appreciate that. Appreciate you. Oh, where do I put this? Man. If I go to the next tier, I get some stats. Like, the tier 2, you get some good stats. I just go for it. I'm gonna go for the stats right now. There's no guarantee that the second affix is even the one I want. Maybe going to tier two is better. Yeah. So now I got 20% elite damage, 130% crit damage. Yeah, I think I, maybe I do at least to level one and then maybe push one to max depending on your build. Life on hit, that's a lot of life on hit. 270 damage, yeah. Maybe I would do that. Because you get a lot with the first tier. And then it just goes to one extra thing and then one extra thing. Yeah, Wish Doctor's gonna be my first main and then I'm gonna branch out, play other builds. I usually end up with like, you know, five plus builds. Usually a lot of builds. Mm -hmm. I mean, this theme buffs up every build in the game, right? That's pretty good. Like Ethereals did, but better. Are they removable? Yeah, they're just like normal gems, I guess. You Or, yeah, normal legendaries. You just put them in, take them out. As much as you want. I think you have to take them out to level them anyway, so... You can't level them in the item. I haven't tried, anyway. You have to take him out to level him up? Okay. Is Diablo Immortal dead? I don't know. For me, it was hard to stream, man. Like, I was getting like back problems, neck problems, elbow problems. I have no issues, right? I have no health issues. It was hard to stream it. And then when I got to endgame, there was a lot of Paragon farming, and I hate Paragon farming like that much. I might as well just play D3, right? So. Cause it's not your, like, you know, you're on a mobile device. Yeah, I was like, eh, like a little, you know, like a little troll. It was really messing me up. It was funny, like, it was funny for the first alpha. I even said it in the panel I was in. It was funny. And then the second, and then the second um, beta came out and I couldn't. The, the first day I'm like, bro, I can't. I had some like deep-seated injury or some shit. I have like some deep-seated injury I didn't know I got from playing it. My body's like no, and I was like I can't, I can't play this. My like I just my elbows are hurting and I don't know. And then the end game is a lot of Paragon farming too, and so it was kind of like those two things. I might as well just play D3 if I want to grind Paragon, you know. You play it on Blue Stacks, yeah. So the controller support would definitely alleviate one of those issues. And then with Lost Ark coming out, I'm like, what is, you know? Maybe if I'm on the go, right? So I have like a newborn in the house and I can't even play on my Switch, but maybe once he's like older, maybe I would play like hanging out in the living room with the family. Like maybe I would play more on the go. You know, so that definitely lifestyle changes too. We got a fragment of destruction. Definitely. But it's going to be free to play. I mean, I definitely check it out. Maybe we'll do a let's play or something. Let's play release, full release. <clears throat> Oh, 
also been a long time in 2018. It's going to be 2022 soon. <laughs> we had to wait four years for Diablo 3 also. You got Essence of Anguish from Arne, did you? Oh, uh, shit. You moved to more mobile games because of a young kid? Yeah. I could be, I could be, like, once, once my son's, like, a little bit older, I could be, like, Immortal could be the best thing for me on the go. Right now, I can't even play on my Switch because he just, newborns need more attention, so I don't know what it's going to be like three months from now. Three months from now, I might be have more time to play, you know? And I might be, like, super excited to play it. But right now, it's like, I game on my PC only, and there's no way I'm not going to play a mobile game over Lost Ark, you know? <laughs> there's just no way. So... But on the go, yeah, I mean, when it's competing against, um, the Switch, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Because when you're on your PC, right, you can play Path of Exile or Diablo 3 or anything, you know. Balloons. Lost Ark are balloons. <laughs> oh, shit. I've been trying to play through, uh, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, man, but yeah, the little baby. Little baby wins. Yeah, all you need is a VPN to play Lost Ark. It's all free to play. I mean, yeah, I have, yeah, I have like 250 MS from uh, the West Coast. It's uh, not even noticeable in PvE, really. In PvP, it's noticeable, but it's fun to learn the game. If you're the type of person that gets burned out, I would just wait till release. It comes out February 11th. You know? If you're not the kind of person that gets burned out, then maybe. It's 100% sure to drop. No, the, the drop rate is not 100%, but it's like 35% ish. Everybody gets different results, but it's definitely not 100. Everybody agrees on that. <laughs> I was super happy to get a beta key and then saw it's banned in my country. Oh, uh, Denmark? I think it's banned in Denmark because it's like gambling or something. I guess there's loot boxes. So League of Legends has loot boxes, is, is that banned? Like League, Overwatch? Like a lot of games have that, right? Oh, Netherlands? Oh shit. Sucks, man. I mean, I guess you could get a VPN also, but you know, it's not everybody likes having to do all that. You've been farming Zoltan for two hours and no soul shard? There's no way you did that. You're, you're trolling me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, PoE has loot boxes also, so that, yeah, that's crazy, man. The gambling thing is real, dude. I remember I bought Pokemon Yellow for my DS and they took away the game corner from that. <laughs> I ran around for, I don't even know how long, and then I Googled it finally. You can't gamble at the game corner. In like the new downloadable ones. I'm like, what the hell, man? <laughs> the Pokemon slots is gambling? They're real about this movement. They're, they're not backing down. They don't want kids to be like addicted, I guess. I don't know. I, I I don't know anybody. I mean, it, people are addicted to gambling, right? So, oh, we got Lakumas finally. So I feel for anybody with like an addiction or whatever. I I don't I don't know anybody with a gambling addiction. So I'm, it's hard for me. 
I know a lot of people that drink too much and smoke too much. <laughs> I don't know anybody that gambles too much, man. This here. You got your first ember? Oh, hell yeah. So we're pretty tanky now. Damn, I didn't roll the physical damage. Shit. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, well, that's fine. You, you did, did you gamble too much? Oh, from Kadala? I see what you did there. It's, they're pretty strong with this movement. I think, um, I don't like loot boxes either that you pay for. I love loot boxes that you earn in the game for free. I think that's fine, but... There's quite a few guys that are gambling addicts and they blow their whole paycheck. Oh shit, really? Yeah, I'm not saying it doesn't exist, but I just feel like there's a lot of effort for... Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's more serious than I realized, you know? Seems like a lot of effort. That they're removing Pokemon from... The Pokemon game came out in like, what, 99? The Game Corner? 1999? Something like that? <laughs> to retroactively go back and fix that? What the hell, man? You're addicted to anything you touch? Mm -hmm. Kids can't even, I guess, yeah, I guess, but kids can't even buy stuff. But. Maybe they have credit cards nowadays. Yeah, those kid credit cards. The green card or whatever it's called. Mm. They ask their parents and then they get addicted that way. If my son asked me to buy loot boxes, I would laugh. I'm like, Are you crazy, bro? What do you think this is? But not everybody knows about video games, so they don't understand what they're asking. Yeah, true. They steal it? Like Gollum or some shit? My precious? My precious uh, Visa? That's a parenting issue, you know? They go in there. <laughs> like this, the famous Gollum where he reaches out. <laughs> and pulls the credit card. <laughs> pulls the credit card out. That's crazy, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just I'm just making jokes. I hate I don't like loot boxes either, honestly. I, I like them in games as a reward though. I think it's really fun. It's like getting a present, you know? I don't like that you pay for them, no. I would rather like Overwatch. I would rather just pay for the skin I want, man. I use it as an example because uh, I was into Overwatch when it came out. And I just wanted the skin that I wanted. I didn't want to have to pay for it. You know, it's like crazy shit. Like, just let me buy it. MasterCard. My master, my precious. Mm -hmm. Boom. Freeze deflector. Use that on another alt. So now that we got Lakumbas, all the Coom, where are we at in the current build? We have the entire base version, I think, except for Ancients, but like, yeah, I, I normally use Squirt's Necklace, we don't have that. I normally use Hellfire, we don't have that, but we have a lot of good base here. It's pretty nice. Maybe we try to fill out, let me bring up my Arakir build. Let's see. Corpse Spiders. We have the belt, we have the Triumph. 
We have Depth Diggers. We have Echoing Fury. We have the Spider. Dude, we have a full Spider set build pretty much. We need to Compass Rose. And of course that Ring of Royal Grandeur. Um, we got the gems. It's a lot of the a lot of the items are similar. Um, that's amazing. We got the ring of emptiness already, which is great. Damn! So we have a spider set built too. Maybe just roll for ancients. And then in the process, we'll get ancient items for spider set. So the spider set we have. No ancients. Not a one. So anything we roll for our main build, we have a chance to get for the offset, right? Not even the offhand. We don't, we don't have a lot. So. I think they'll just kind of all happen organically here. Which is great. In terms of legendary gems, we need the Teguk. That's the only thing different. So we'll go with that. We'll level that at some point. 25 and then we get to 25. Thirteen runs, you got your Rorg. Damn, son. Damn, son. I wonder what lot build he's using. Oh, dagger darts. Okay. Cool. You better be ready. I'm coming for you, boy. You coming? Better be ready. Get my title back. Mm -hmm -hmm. I'm just forever out of keys, like. Never ending. If you're out there. The Condi, nice. Open, open, open. Let's go. Damn, Hamlin got wrecked. Another Soul Shard. One that we're never going to use. Tal Rasha offhand. Pretty good. Stoner achievement. Let's go. I didn't inhale. Not guilty.
So the, I guess mojos would be the best because that's a huge damage increase or weapons. And the mojos used for both. As much as I want ancient items, I mean, that's going to be the biggest, the biggest upgrade. We roll crudest boots on our monk, like Conan said, <laughs> for the alt. Are there any legendary gems which work for the follower? Yeah, the um, defensive gems work on your follower, like Mutilation Guard, Esoteric. The legendary Soul Shard theme does work only for the stats though, not the actual powers themselves. But, like, you know how they have stats on it or whatever? Andy. Teddy Bear is dead ahead. Another pair of ice climbers I could use an ancient. We got ponies invading the rift. Yeah, I rolled monk in the beginning and then got no crudest boots and I'm like, all right, let's just play witch doctor or something random. Something maybe a secondary thing I wanted to play. Deep down inside, I always wanted to play Doc. It gave me a reason. I was really playing Monk, like I said. It was just too good to pass up, you know? Like with Crudus Boots, it was just insanely powerful. Just too crazy, man. But since I didn't get the boots, it gave me an excuse to kind of play off meta like always. If you need a follower build, type exclamation mark follower, or on my website I have all that. This is like random shit I put together. Monk is the best start if you get the boots, yeah. If not, then probably it's close between Witch Doctor and Demon and then Necromancer for leveling. But at 70, you know, Demon Hunter is a beast, a Barb can be a beast, a lot of builds, you know. It depends on, I guess, drops like we are saying. Wizard takes some time to get going. Arc here. We got another Spider Queen Grass. Hopefully it's ancient, especially if we play tomorrow, play uh, Spider Dock. Let's see. No, 750 though, that's not the worst. Non-ancient, sucks.
Mundanugu. Two. So now we have five keys. All right, let's do some pushing for fun. Five keys, might as well go for it. Do we empower it? Shh, that's like all my gold. You got two embers on T16? I only got two all night, man. Grats. I got two embers for the whole night. Grats. This way, this way, this way. <laughs> Shankrani's pretty nice. Especially if you have to run back, maybe, and pop a pylon on a different floor, you can get back pretty easily. There'll be no elites if you kill them all. Or 20? All right, season over. That's it. We're sticking to it. Done and done, chat. Go up here, sometimes there's an elite, nothing. Nada. Then not another. Oh, there we go. Ninety nine percent. This might do it just right here. Just trash. Vesalius. Not getting burned as fast as he could. There we go. Whoa. We got a gift. Oh, we got our squirts finally. Damn, I hope it rolls well. <laughs> Damn. Ice climbers could be ancient. Hopefully. Seven thirty seven. 
Work on crit damage here. Life. All res. And then probably, I guess, gold pickup radius. That's our third gift. I never got this many gifts this early, I don't think. Ooh, this is... A, like a lot, like a DPS loss, but... Uh, maybe. You lucky with gifts? Yeah, I think I've been lucky. Time to crash. Thanks for hanging out, Armadin. I appreciate you guys hanging out, dude. I'll be live um, all day tomorrow also. It's a waste of resources if I don't get it. Ne all right, well, we have it in the bank. I don't want to put it, I right now I have a nested Johan in there. I guess I could just throw it in the cube. I guess we could. I'll take the Kool-Aid also. Put this away. I'm just thinking about it. How many DBs do we have? A lot? 432? Let's do it. Time to die again, just when we got tanky. I'm like, I'm just thinking about how <laughs> we finally got our tank and then we're gonna go ahead and do this. You too? All right, man, no worries, dude. Have a good night, guys. Thanks for the chill times. Yeah, probably like, um, you know, in the season kind of calms down a little bit. Early season, I think I'm gonna do group runs, play. I might, I might have like an alt. Play some hardcore. I might do like um, a no cheat death run or something like that. Cause um, I haven't died really in two seasons, which is like pretty much the whole year last year. Or the whole 2021. I keep thinking it's November or January already. You're looking for a power level? Maybe someone will level you, yeah? You drop your battle tag, I guess. Maybe someone will add you. I don't care if people ask for power levels, and, and as long as they're not spamming or being crazy, you know? Can't hurt to ask. Mm. You got the Innis ball rolling?
Foe Fody. This one was pretty chill. 82. Eleven overall, and that is yeah, eleven overall. And then on the on the lawn on the lawn we're climbing to. Well, it hasn't updated yet because we just did an eighty-two. So the leaderboard is even lagging behind. And the leaderboard is dying. Do you not upload the vods? Um, I never uploaded the full vod. You mean like just the let's play? Like just like this, the segmented let's play. Um, I've been live the whole season, so I'm not like, I can't. Yeah, I don't unless I had like a producer or someone to help me out. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, <laughs> I've been live, man. What do you mean? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, we got an Amber. We got an Amber. I'm here. Um. Where do I want to put it though? Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Mm -hmm. Strength, just what I never wanted. Mm. You thought I went to bed? No, no, the and I'm playing on North America, so Nah. I've been live. Oh, it said rank one in clan chat? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I think it's lagging behind. I'm gonna run out of keys anyway before two keys. Thousand strength is tankiness. Hope I get one more amber, then we can see what our second affix is on the item. That'd be great. Mm -hmm. A lot of times it won't even be ready tomorrow too because YouTube it's probably be like a what unless I break it up maybe Yeah, because it would be how long has this season been active? Nine hours so if I do like two five hour episodes, maybe the five hours will render in time. The 10 hour video might not even be ready by Saturday, honestly, but maybe if I break it up and do two five hours, it'll, it'll go up there. The soul shards or the currency, the, they, they both drop by just playing the game. 
bosses have a higher chance to get soul shard drops. That's why we do like level one boss bosses and stuff like that. But yeah, you just play the game and they just drop speed farm. Mm-hmm. If you need builds or level guides or I don't know explanations, like I have a website right here with all kinds of Diablo stuff. A tier list right there. That's the link to the website. I don't know something. Ninety seven percent. Let's go. I always get reinvigorated when I solo push. It's just fun to see where your character's at. Dragon Lies, so we just did a kill the Rift Guardian, right? And then we got one of the soul shards from him. They have a higher chance to drop from like RGs, um, bounty bosses, things like that. It's crazy not to be even that far away from the Arakir builds because the Arakir builds get that full damage, like 17,000 damage, but it's crazy. <laughs> Arakir is so much stronger this early on because we don't even have our, like, our, our damage bonus, like I'm saying. To even be close, pretty wild. With dagger darts, man. Freaking la dot. Bottomless Kool Aid. Put the Kool Aid away. Go for that mojo for that power. Zuni offhand used to be the meta because it has fetish damage on it, but this Shankrani is probably the way to go now. Just straight up damage. What, two more?
That'd be sick if we get another ember, man. I'm hoping. I was wishing and praying and hoping. Watch those arcane beams, blood. Sneak up on you. Don't sleep on La Dodd. I remember it being amazing having a skill to complete a 90 plus at the end of a season. Now you can do it the first day. It's just, uh, yeah, you just have to adjust your expectations, right? So, so like 90 is not impressive anymore. Now it's like 130 plus, 140 plus. I guess it's the same concept. Just the numbers change. Like in WoW Classic, hitting 60 was amazing, but now it's like, you know... Well, it's different, but yeah, now the number is so much higher. 120 or whatever the max level is, 130, I don't even know anymore. Oh, they went back to 60, right? Okay. Went back to 60. Level squish. If you don't have the poison damage on your weapon and skills don't deal poison damage, is the anguish gem useless? Yeah, people are saying that your follower can proc it also with poison damage, but I haven't tested that. Um, you want it on your main hand weapon or... Yeah. Have a poison skill. You're more casual these days, I feel that. You just tested it, it works? Okay, well there you go. Well there you go. You heard it here first, chat. Seven. Can you combine two of the same soul shards? What do you mean, like a fusion? No. You have to, there's a currency that drops that you use to upgrade it. Fusion! One key left. One lonely key.
Forest map? I'll take it. Uh oh. Take it easy, boys. Take it easy. Hey. If you guys just tuned in, um, or if you passed out, hello, I'm in your dreams now. If you're just tuning in, we're playing off meta Lod Dodd. Just doing a little bit of pushing on my last key. I'm in your dreams like Freddy. I'm coming for you. Blood is coming for you. Three, four. Better lock your door. <laughs> Five, six. You better get off. Wait. T6. I forgot where I was going with that. Mm, I'm gonna be like T6. Okay, so it looks like we're okay on this 91, but maybe it's approaching where I have to actually try. Yeah, it looks like it's an open map, right? So it's like, it's really favorable. We're gonna hit 500 Paragon, that's nice. T6. Launch Netflix, there you go. Seven, eight. You're gonna grind all late. Boom, 500. <clears throat> Boom, we hit it faster than I thought. I think this gets so much, this is the, uh, yeah, open map. High GR for me right now. Or for the Paragon that I have, anyway. It depends on the most important gem for your build, right? Some builds really need a certain one. I would maybe give one to one of each. That's what I did. I don't regret it, but... Because... The max level could be one you don't want. It's there's like three random possibilities, right? So you can get the wrong one. So if you invest heavily into something, then you might be disappointed. But if you go one and one. So I would go one and one and then max one. And then max the second one. That first tier you get like a lot of stats for it. It seems to be worth. That first tier you get a grip of stats, and then after that you only get one thing. But, yeah, that's just like my first thought of doing it that way. Yeah, they're kind of meant to be farmed. I got strength on my Witch Doctor, yeah. So that's unfortunate. On the Terror Gem. But... I got the armor from it, so I guess I could gem... Intelligence, right? And then get the armor, I guess.
I don't think I'm using confidence ritual right now, so that would be more damage we can pull out. I'm using cheat death. And add a gem, sadly. Add a gems, chat. Ring for with La Dodd. Come on, man. You guys gotta step it up. Is Biden still an issue? Uh, yes. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Feels bad. How long has the season been out? Type exclamation mark countdown. And that'll work in reverse. It'll say how long the season's been out. It's like we got another ring of emptiness. 266 though. Another ring of emptiness. We got three ring of emptinesses. What the fuck? Crazy. A double crit Hana Vaxo. E yes, please. If I can get a socket on it. Like, this is good for now. Please. Thank you. More damage. You got a primal Kreider shot? Hit me with the Kreider shot. Sorry. It's getting to that time where I'm getting delirious. Just deleted a dagger of darts. At least it wasn't ancient. Not so bad. I haven't got a primal. I've only, only got the one primal, actually. So maybe I'm due for another primal. Think of the deep ancient. We gotta farm some keys. Hmm. 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 Own it. Yeah, four overall, and then on the lawn we got rank one on lawn. That's pretty good. From where we started. Leveled up with no multiplier, hit 70, doing T1 with no multiplier. Come a long way, chat. Ooh, Arik here. Two piece? We have two piece Wrath of the Waste right now. How funny. The way it all shakes out, you know? <laughs> Two piece of barb. And I think we have like a few barb items too, like the bash weapon. I have not got a goblin pack today, so I would I would appreciate that kind of RNG. We did get a, like three puzzle rings though. I saved one in case I level my boon to 25, I can get a little bit more juice out of it, but. Another Arakir piece, oh my god. 
Yeah, I'm playing softcore this season. Uh, I'm gonna do solo maybe over the weekend or for a few days and then play with my community. After that. And then um, maybe play hardcore after a month or so when things calm down. Maybe do like a no... Maybe do like a no cheat death run. Something cracked out. Yeah, I haven't played softcore um, in years or done community runs since like four years. I'm not even joking. I've been streaming for five years, right? Over five. It's been a while, dude. And with the extra cheat death from your follower, I died like one time in 2021. Like it makes me really tanky. I guess, I guess I'm like, I feel almost invincible if, if I want to be. So after not having it for a lot of years, it feels like, you know, really powerful. So I might take it away. Just do a self-imposed. Maybe I'll do that every season. Play some softcore with the homies and then, um, you know, once it dies down a little bit, then kind of uh, spice things up for me. What's the level one item for DH from Kadala? I don't roll a level one. I wait till like 34, I think, and my level guide. And I go for quivers. Yeah, but you can go for Poxfalds or a lot of people like Hellcat Waste Guard. Freaks, I call them. But a lot of people like that. <laughs> if you type exclamation mark T I E R. I have a web page with like leveling guides, cheat sheets. It might help you out if you haven't played in a while. Like videos all pertaining to the season. A lot of people just coming back to the game. It's a good season to come back. Come back to. Good season. I'd say. Uh, why is it a good season to come back? Because uh, the seasonal theme's fun? I don't know. Because everybody likes restarts, or a lot of people like restarts. How should I go about getting Ring of Royal Grandeur? I would wait till T12 or T13. I promise you, no build in the game needs it for T12 or T13. It's like a trap, you know? You could get lucky and get it right away, but it's such a low chance. It's, it's nutty, man. Something like on T6 is a 10% chance to get one singular item from a bounty. One item, and there's like five items to choose from. Right, and then you go to T7, I think it goes to 50%. So that's, T7's a nice break point. So you have a 50% chance to get one of the five items. You can see how you can be running all night. I think it's something like that. You can go to uh, d3resource.com and look at the chart. If you wait till T13, you get a guaranteed two items, which is really good. Oh, T6 is 100? Is it? Uh, okay. Yeah, I would definitely, um, I think it's right here.
you can get lucky, right? And get it whenever, right? We can go to the website and then... Obviously, you can get it, but... RNG, difficulty overview. <clears throat> so you're gonna look for... Herodric Cash Legendaries. It's like 10% to T1. Oh, my bad. My bad. 10% to T1. And then it goes 50% T2, 60, 75. To, so you get 100%. So T6 probably would be the bare minimum. Or T5 is 90% is pretty high too. Maybe 90%. You know? And then T13 is guaranteed to get two. That's why I wait till T13. Especially with the the seasonal theme, it's pretty easy to level. Yeah, so T13 you get two. So there's you know there's five items total. I believe there's five ish. You have a fifty almost like maybe a forty percent chance to get the item you need every run. Math? I don't know. You're destroying T8? Yeah, I would just wait. You don't you don't need it. Only build that maybe needs Ring of World Grandeur, maybe is like charge bar, but nobody's playing charge bar, you know. And you can still play Raycord at T12. Mm. <laughs> You're Gucci man. Um, people don't know, right? Or they come back to the game and they just find a build and they follow it. Maybe I should put in my descriptions. Don't farm Ring of World Grandeur early. <laughs> and all the build descriptions. Save all the heartache. Heartache and pain. I need it for Arik here tomorrow, but we'll see. I hate farming bounties. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Grats on your weapon, dude. Oh, the helm? Grats. You want to know what my 70 primal was? It's pretty original. I'll tell you if you want to know. You could probably guess it, honestly. It was Blackthorns, yeah it was. Shocking. <laughs> mm-hmm. Not even the pants either. You think the pants maybe would be legit. Blackthorns, ladies and gentlemen. I think it was the chest piece, maybe. I don't know why I wasn't using it the whole time. Maybe because I just got disgusted and threw it in the stash. Well, I'm using Aquila now, but at the time I maybe could have used it. I have to look. I don't remember what it was, actually. Gotta love it. Yeah, you hate to see it, man. I might want to save a pylon for the Rift Guardian. Our Rift Guardian's a little slow right now. Morning Blood, which build is an easy laid back build to run? I mean, Inna's Wave of Light. I mean, no, I'm sorry. Inna's Mantra, Ally, Mystic Ally is pretty chill. There's a lot of builds that are fun, you know? 
Um, the new Marauder set's chill, but you have to cast your sentries a little bit. If you like multi-shot, it's like the original, or it's like the old school Marauder. The sentries automatically cast your spenders, and they mimic you. That's like a new thing. They're both like new, new-ish. I guess the end has been around for one season, but yeah, new-ish. Uh, a lot of Witch Doctor revamps. With items, quality of life changes, the spider set got revamped. God DH? If you haven't played Diablo in a while, God DH would be the number one answer. People love that build. It's like a strafe build. I don't know when's the last time you played, but yeah, God DH should be really fun. If you type exclamation mark T I E R, I have a tier list and I put like little fun symbols by the build by the builds I think are fun. And all the builds are on my website. I put a little F and I put a little H for hardcore friendly. How the mats looking? Pretty good. I mean, my general materials suck, but I mean, yeah, not good at all, actually. Actually, not good at all. Mm -hmm. Pew 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 pew. Hello? What? Let me in! Mm -hmm. Yeah, 15 dBs? Did you give your follower the sage set? Did you do that? How are you already 93? Level tier 93. Uh, just using the right build. Pretty much. Fixes everything. Oh, we got an NG on. Shit. Learning all the builds. Stuffs. Mm-hmm. Learning all the things. You're not playing hardcore blood? I know. I would have played hardcore had I thought this would affect this many people, honestly. I would have. I would have. <laughs> I didn't think anybody cared, man. To be honest. But I became synonymous with hardcore, I guess. Um, yeah, I'm going to do community runs this season and then make hard hardcore character later. Later, later. True. Three keys left. I think I'm cool here. I'll push on arc here tomorrow and me and mess around. I think I'm cool. Farm some keys. Get ready for arc here. I got my law gem to 80. So we got to get enforcer up and all that. And then, um, Taeguk. Taeguk for Arik here. Okay. Let's do T16. Let me save this. La dot. Uh, am I getting off? No, I'm streaming right now. Maybe later. 
Let's see. Grass, yeah, spirit vessel. Languish. Let's go. <laughs> Do you roll one handed daggers at the beginning? If you're playing Demon Hunter, it doesn't really matter, right? So, yeah, whatever you want. I'm trying to think how it would matter. Uh, maybe if... Like, if you upgrade your daggers and you get a Carly point, then maybe go for Holy Point Shot Quiver, I guess? That's maybe a little bit. I don't know if it matters. I'm at the point where I'm thinking, do I stay? Or do I sleep for hours and come back? I always have this conversation every season. We do the four hour nap. Stay easy clap. Maybe I got used to staying up all night with the baby, a newborn baby in the house. You slept for two and a half and you're decently refreshed. Mm -hmm. That's good. Decently refreshed. I probably would sleep for four, wake up, get breakfast, and be back in five total, something like that. I have to upload this video to YouTube also, so that's probably what stops me. People like watching these. Also. Bam, bam. You made your you made your follower a full ancient set, really? <laughs> Damn. Our followers usually get geared out more than us, right? I have more primals anyway. That's the sc demon screams in this rift. We need to farm Avarice Band at some point. <clears throat> I guess we could use Thing of the Deep on Witch Doctor. That might be something. It's a little ghetto Avarice Benton. If only we had... Um, corruption Shoulders. Old school Corruption Shoulders. That might be better. I got my first Goblin Rift! I was saying! I was saying, chat. I didn't get one yet. Put this odious in the dirt. Damn. I was saying I haven't got one. You just landed one too? I don't think I missed any. Beautiful. What if we got any embers or anything from it? <clears throat> Could be a cane set, a possible cane set in our future. You heard one in the game, you got full surround sound. You heard it on my stream, you heard it on your game. <laughs> Goblins everywhere, dude. There's a ring. Ashira. Guardian. Guardian. Hollow Defenders. K9. 
Kane's fate. I don't remember which. I always I always forget which one it is. Let's see. It is the low level one. Boo. Two patterns though. That's good. Another Joel Crafting one. We got like three recipes from Joel Crafting. Okay. Another Arakir piece, hopefully ancient. Or quads, maybe. Triple quad. Look at me now. A Another RNA, but three RNA belts. I don't need them, but I'm going to bank it. I'm going to hoard it anyway, dude. All right, where's my primal at? I'm curious to see what it was. It was a chess piece. Yeah. I could have used it until I got the Aquila. Damn Blackthorn. Reusable parts. I think a lot of us just, um, there's a recipe in the cube to, to balance out your materials. But yeah, you can do battlefields. You can do battlefields for sure. It still works. You can grab the, uh, item racks. Yeah, no problem. Oh, so many bugs. Jade gloves. You got Pinos? Cheers, man. Pinos is good. I hope you got Crudus Boots first. <laughs> I hope that was the secondary one, yeah. I'm happy North America and EU didn't have those Asia issues. Man, I was playing. It was rough, dude. I thought we were going to have the issues too. Like some people on their character, like let's say you log out and log back in. It logs in your seasonal character to non-season. It's weird, man. There was a lot of glitches and shit. A lot of people, I had that issue on one of my characters. I was like, wait, what happened? <laughs> The only way I believed that I wasn't crazy is I was recording it for the video. I went back and watched it. Did you see people having 1.5k after one hour? Yeah, there's all kinds of weird issues, yeah. Yeah, some guy had like a care package or something when he logged in. Really weird stuff, man. I don't know, it's like some alien took the server away. Oh, we just got two embers? Oh, shit. That's beautiful. Like some really bizarre things I've never seen before in Diablo. All right, Wheezy Man, I'll see you tomorrow, dude. Thank you. I just want to, I want to roll these. I like, I like these embers, man.
Here we go, boys. The top tier of the Terror Gem. Please have attack speed. Um, for Corpse Spiders, I actually use the fire damage though. So, I guess they're not a total waste. A ring of fire, the one thing I hate. <laughs> Damn you, bastard. Stupid ring of fire. I should have went drag gem. The ring of fire. Damn, double crit. Nice. Well. What are you going to do? Level another one. My Asia seasonal character just became non-season when the server restarted. Yes, that's weird, right? Like a lot of stuff like that. People were saying all kinds of stuff in chat that was happening to them. That happened to me, but then it went back again to season, so I don't know. I was like, I hope EU doesn't have this problem in NA. It's gonna ruin the whole everything, you know? That start's so important. Nice clean launch. Another unity, wow. <laughs> Rocky launches? Yeah, nothing's changed, man. Some things don't change. Some things never change, dude. Hey Blood, does the thorns from the Soul Shard work on Thorns Necro? Yeah, I don't see why not. It's, it goes on your sheet damage, right? So yeah, it should it should work 100%. I never tested it because it should work. Yeah, somebody said they had ethereals, and yeah, somebody did say that too. They had ethereals in their game and soul shards or something. That's crazy, man. I don't even know. Like, it's like you had to be there. Or you, like, if you go on the forums, I think people were reporting all kinds of stuff. I don't even know. It's like the flash drive fell into the river or something. The server just got kicked out the window. It was the Wild West. It was like the multiverse, man. It was crazy. Yeah, what's up, man? I was like, do I even make this video? Because, like, what if the whole server is not even right? And I was like, I don't know, I'm just gonna make it. And it ended up working out, but I almost didn't even make the video, because I'm like, is this... Is this even how it's going to be on NAEU or is this completely like metaverse shit here? Alternate reality. I hope the last season before D3 ever shuts down is all seasons combined. That would be pretty crazy. Might as well. The best way to farm gems is to kill Zoltan Cool over and over and destroy the shards. Yeah. Yeah, I like Wizard for T1. Uh, it's really strong. The gener the primary ability and the spender is really good. Mm -hmm. So you can just use Wizard to farm it and then play whatever you want after that. All the classes can do it, but I found Wizard to be the most... Uh, Chillest. You get rare frost right when you hit level two also.
You're 800 Paragon and starving for gems and augments? The best way to farm regular gems is to give your follower a broken crown and just do T like T16, I guess. Or do well technically do puzzle rings. That's like you get like 23 Imperials a run. But not everybody has infinite puzzles right now. I haven't got a broken crown yet. I kind of want to farm enough materials to be able to roll all my spider ducks, spider dock stuff too. And not have any issues because there's going to be like a, you know, I need sockets everywhere and stats. Even in the battlefield map, there's weapon racks everywhere. Got him. Whenever you do puzzle rings, blood, switch out your helm shard for a broken crown and a normal gem. It's true. You can give it to your follower and it counts unless you do them in groups. Oh, helm shard, you're right, yeah. Helm Shard, specifically. Mm -hmm. A Fjord Cutter, watch out. Seismic Slam Barb. Ancient Channeling Shoulders. I'll take out the non-ancients, I guess. Hilltooth, another Unity, which is credible. Lidless Wall. With physical damage, we can give it to thorns, maybe. We're rolling for mojos, looking for the triumph ancient. So the one I have here, just an ancient version of it. More power. Ooh, I love this map. It lost my challenger status, but kept my first Hadrid gift pouch in the mail. That's weird, man. Yeah. Oh, another consumable. Very good. It's going to hit level rank three. I hope it's the pet one. I got to go. I got to check this. It's my favorite thing to do since it's new.
Here we go. No. Killing an enemy reduces all your active cooldowns by five seconds. Damn. It's not the pet one, dude. It's basically an augment now. I got two gems, not the ones I need. Damn, damn, damn. Another ember? Oh, lordy. Starting to drop. I'm on the loot server, dude. Stay classy. I, a broken crown with the new gems? I bet you it still works. It'll just give you a random gem, but I haven't tested it, actually. That's a good question. I don't know if anybody's tested it. I didn't even, on the PTR, I didn't even think we thought about it. Or it didn't come up in conversation. The, you played season 25? I think season 25 is great. The last one you played was 22, you mean? Or I mean? <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. Uh, I think, yeah, I mean, if you're a Diablo fan, Diablo 3 fan, yeah. I think so. I'm a big fan, dude. The thumbnail should have like monk let's play and then monks crossed out and then it says witch doctor underneath. <laughs> and then it says Arakir and then it crossed out Arakir and put Lod Dodd. <laughs> Iculus with the big 50 months, my dude. Thank you, man. Just everything crossed out. Two more Arakir pieces. And a compass rose. Damn. I have a slot right for you right here, bruh. Some homing pads. We have another drag gem. I saved it just for this occasion. 297. 24 elite damage, 142. Has more crit damage, more average. Life per hit. It's just a higher rank right now. Cool. We'll put more embers on it when we get it. It gives nothing? Aw, oh, that sucks. I guess for T16, if you need gems, you know, you might not even use the helm gem then. If you're running puzzle rings, you could just take it off. But it sucks not to use it, like, full time. You have that many Hellforge Embers? That's crazy, man. That's like 28 Embers? You just do it, are you doing group speeds? Damn. 
What do you think is more chill? High GR, Firebird? I don't know how high it could push. I have a speed version on my website. I don't know if like EB can even push that high. It's all about applying your combustion stack super fast. So I don't know. I think flame blade, I think the spectral blade hits way faster, you know? You got that many playing solo? God damn, bro. I mean, Monk is like pretty, are you playing Monk maybe? Damn. Monk farm's pretty cracked out, so. Or like Demon Hunter with God DH. We got some swampies, old school. Yeah. Yeah, Monk's really fast, so your efficiency is really high. You're probably getting so many kills per hour, so many clears per hour. Good job, man. That's a lot of embers right there. Dang. A little bit of RNG, a little bit of efficiency. Bring it all together. I got a blue screen earlier. I thought my video card exploded. Yeah, I got both off of Diablo too. Yeah. It's pretty satisfying when that happens. There's another one. They're starting to drop, maybe. Maybe I had bad luck earlier and now it's fixing itself. You got your first level 20. Grats. Good. <laughs> Gen Monk Helm. You started with nothing, but it picked up. Ah, that's crazy. Yeah, that kind of happened to me a little bit. No hope of cane, no blood shard. I just farmed a dreg gem and that was my start. Thank you for the 13 months. Cheers. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Scourge. I'm not playing Gen Monk, so. How do you make your Han autocast? Uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't know, like some kind of cheat program, macro. I don't know. <laughs> I just cast it. If you use, um, if you use Lingering Spirit, it looks like it goes on its own. Like if you use Lingering Spirit, it, like, it sits there and finds another target and then finds another target. It looks like it's going on its own, I guess. 
But to cast it? I mean, I don't know. You were really bummed out and then it just started dropping like candy? All right, Infamous, yeah, I'll be back in the morning too. I gotta, I'll probably, same. I gotta edit this, I gotta put this video up on YouTubes and... Get like a few hours sleep, that way I can stream all day Saturday. Uh, for me it's only, it's three in the morning, so it's not bad. Not too bad. But I'm at the point where I could just stay up and then but then I'm gonna end tomorrow early. It's almost like doing two back to back streams or sleeping and doing two moderately lucid streams. Or one one alert and one not alert. Or one alert, and then one half tired. <laughs> the choice is the choices. You got three in one gift and grift. Oh my god! The most I ever got is two so far. So you got me beat. You got me beat. Mm. You know, 3 a.m. to 6 a.m. Whoa. Oh, another triumph, hopefully ancient. Another Fjord Cutter, how weird. I've gotten so many, I've like two or three piece Whirlwind set. I got two Fjord Cutters. Like some other random barb stuff. It's calling me man, the Frenzy Barb. Barb in general. Come home, blood. We miss you. Later, Eburn. Thanks for hanging, dude. Is there a best GR100 to speed? Like a breakpoint? Uh, it depends on the season, right? So like this season, like monks, you're playing monk, monks should be able to speed 120s like in two minutes. But it depends on your paragon, your levels, you know, all that kind of stuff, your augments. You should be able to destroy like a GR120 in two minutes, something like that. Or like in the past, farming Paragon at 105 with Monk was really good. 110. Now it's like 120, I'd say. With Monk, or with like S tier builds. 115s with A plus tier, maybe. 